seems to be a lot of good athletes out here hoping to come out here, get some good work in, you know, come out here and compete. With all these guys from across Virginia, how do you plan uh, on separating yourself from all these guys? My, uh, my work ethic, you know, it's kind of, I'm just different than other guys. You're at a program now that's, that's known for winning. How have you uh, added to that legacy and how do you plan on adding to that legacy? Sure. Uh, by uh, uplifting my teammates, you know, you know, building them up. You know, getting them ready for game time. Yeah. And tell me some of the qualities that go into being a team leader. Mm -hmm. Being able to, uh, to lead by example. That's what I do. I lead by example, you know, let my game talk, you know, kind of follow. How would you define yourself as a player? I'd say I'm a teammate first player, most definitely. What are some of the most important things that goes into being uh, a successful program? You up next? I say the chemistry, most definitely. You know, getting to know all your guys, making sure you know they're all on the same page and you know the same goal. How has the recruiting process gone for you? The recruiting process has been kind of slow as of right now, but uh, it's starting to pick up a little bit. It's good to know. Uh, what are, who are some of the schools that are interested in you? I've been talking to uh, Norfolk State, uh, Western Carolina, you know, a few D3 schools also. How does it feel to have those teams reach out to you and say they like to watch you for their program? It feels good to know that they uh, recognize me for my talent. I will talk about the exposure you have gotten. Uh, I've gotten a lot of exposure, you know, working out with uh, Giovanni over at TNEO for about a year and a half. He's got me right. How has that guy gotten you better? Well, he's been. I've been working on my agility, my speed, my strength. I've been working with him for the past year and a half. It's a real deal. All right. Uh, with the possibility of there being a spring season, what do you do in preparation for that? Continue to work out four to five days a week with Giovanni and getting work in by myself.